Good morning. We, what's up? Yeah, uh, lots of stuff is up. They finally got done. They did. Um, you, you know, if if we're gonna get sheep, we should we should probably shut that. Yeah, we don't let them run out into the road. That would be bad. Yeah, I don't I don't think insurance would like that. Hey, this was not easy. It took a swift boot and a small envelope to get this done, but it is done. Yeah, um... What did they need all that wood over here for? I don't know. Like... I don't... I don't... None of this... Like... It doesn't even look like they used the wood that they had here. No, there was a lot of beams. I think there was a delivery mix-up. Oh, okay. And okay. FYI, you're not allowed to bathe in this. Aww. I don't want to have can to get you dewormed again. Can I, go, can I at least go swimming? No. Aww. I do Fine, not, I do not want to pay for that. We got, we got a lake. We, we, need, we need sheep. We do need sheep, but unfortunately we're broke. Yeah. You've been... You, you've been did, did they catch you with your two aces? They did. Oh. We've had a setback in our in our fiscal situation. Just a little bit of a setback. But good news. We are ready to harvest our cannolis. Ooh. Cannoli harvest. Okay. Yeah. Also, um can can you explain something to me? I can try. Just, just come here. Please. Do I have to use big, small words or big words? Uh you can use whatever words you want. Running through trees. Oh, there we are. How how did we how did we get this? So there were some trades made. Yeah, the the Rosal Mash is gone. Yeah, I saw that. And uh, I had a long conversation with a very smart man at the bar late at night. Okay. And he said, "This is this is how you harvest stuff." Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, with cloth. Okay, I understand. What's this? I had no idea. It's got a big big tube on it though. Um, why do we need two augers? I don't know. So here, here's here's the scenario. He, he drew this on a napkin, so I'm trying to remember this, which I used to wipe my face with, so I lost the napkin. But you take the stuff in the class, put it in okay. the thing with the tube on it. The thing with this the one? tube. I, I would guess. No, the small one. Oh, the small one? The thing with the tube goes into the big thing. And then the big thing goes into our semi. Uh. Okay. I. I I see how that would work, but why don't we just use the big thing? Listen, this is how they said it's supposed to be done. Do you wanna Do you wanna look foolish over here, or do you wanna do it the way they do it? Fair enough. Fair enough. We, yeah, we can we can try and assimilate to the culture, I guess. I don't understand it either, if I'm being honest. But this is how they told me to do it, so... Wait, couldn't we... Couldn't we do it the other way? That way that way we don't have to drive the, the, com the combine over to this deal all the time? The little one? Uh, sure. We put the class into the big boy, the big boy into the tube thing, and the tube thing into the semi? Yeah! Okay. We'll go with that. Like I said, the napkin's gone, so I lost I lost the instructions. I mean, I, I think I think that would work right. Let's try it. May, maybe it's tall enough. I don't, I don't. know. It looks shiny. It does. It looks very shiny. Very nice. That's a very big engine. All right. How about you move the class over there? I'll grab the header. And then we'll start setting up seven augers. Okay. So many augers. Oh yeah, it'll fit. Oh, that's a little bit of space-time continuum there. Perfect. Yeah, this is gonna be it's gonna work out well. You know what the fun part is? That auger what? wagon has a bigger capacity than the semi. Oh. Ah. Green, green means money, right? Green means money.
Oh, I'm not close enough. This is genuine UK farming right here. Oh yeah. See, and everybody thought we didn't know what we were doing. Uh, they were probably right. Yeah, probably. Yeah, I'm really confused how this system's gonna work. I'm kind of running into stuff down here. Seems like a lot of trouble. I think it is a lot of trouble, but if that's the way they do it, that's the way they do it. I'm repositioning. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to make it to the house. I can't unload into here. That's... I was kind of wondering how well that was going to work. All right, I'm full. I'm struggling. I mean, why don't why don't we just you know, let's just put, let's just put that in the uh in in the in the com or in the trailer. Would we'll unload into there? Yeah, it seems like a extra step that is unnecessary. Yeah. yeah. Are you sure he just wasn't trying to mess with you since you're a foreigner? I mean, I think he did get a commission out of it. Uh, yeah, I think he was just trying to mess with you. He did have a Perard t-shirt on. Oh. All right. Yeah. We're getting rid of that thing. Yeah, I think we got bamboozled. After uh, after we get this unloaded, I'll give the bank a call and see if a uh, weight can be brought over to the house. There we go. That is, if they approve it. Well, they already got one of my kidneys, so I can't have the other. Yeah, you, those are kind of important. I'm Tokyo oh, drifting wow. all the way to you. My butt off the ground? A little bit. It's, it's a little high. All right, let's try that. I think that's a little better. What was that? We should make canola oil. I'm down. Could be oil barons. Ooh. I like the way that sounds. I get the monocle. Aww. I wanted the monocle. Nope. nope. Seniority. Okay. Can I get the pocket watch? All right. You can have the pocket watch. Yes. Do you even know how to tell time on a regular pocket watch? How? What? Yes! I'm just saying, you know, you got all these fancy phones nowadays. I don't know if you guys know how to tell time anymore. How young do you think I am? I don't know. I don't even know how old you they, are. They, they, they didn't have the all the fancy digital clocks whenever I was growing up. Mm -hmm. I grew up with the normal clock. Okay, don't get don't get upset. Don't need to get your knickers in a twist. I will twist my knickers all I want. One good thing about me driving on this side is you can't look over and see that giant potato field that we got to harvest. This is this is a very good point. I mean, I can still see a little bit of it, but not not too much to you know, get the anxiety levels up. Hey, we made a bunch of money from those potatoes. We did. I'm just not looking forward to doing it again. 
or I think one load with the semi might get us out of debt. We're gonna have to find ourselves a Tesco's and go crazy. Mm-hmm. No more canned can chicken for us. Can you can you think of all the uh all, all the food that we can buy? And we're not gonna have to survive on canned chicken and uh fruit gushers. I do like fruit gushers though. I know, I'm still gonna be buying some. You get a little hyper on fruit gushers though. Well, that's because you're not supposed to have sugar. I'm buying a fancy suit. <sighs> I don't I don't want a fancy suit, because that means I gotta wear a tie and I don't I don't like ties. No, you wear an like ascot. Something's choking me. They wear an what, ascot what the over heck here. What is that? You don't know what an ascot is? No. It's like a fancy tie. No, oh, is it tight? No, it's very loose. It's like a it's like a scarf for your neck. Oh, but what if it's hot out? Look, you gotta you gotta suffer a little bit to be a gentleman. Oh, but I don't want to suffer. Well, stiff upper lip, chap. All right, fair enough. I I almost ran over some birds. Good thing they flew away though. I think the Audubon Society was founded in uh, in America. I don't know if they have huh? one over here. The what? The Audubon Society. Seriously, do you watch anything educational? I, in all honesty, I just pay attention to crop prices and funny, funny videos on the internet. You got a full truck. Ooh. Just have I'm, to make it over there without crashing. You'd be all right for a minute. Yeah, I'm 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 just doing nine miles an hour, like, like we've been. Okay. But slowly losing my mind. I still don't understand why we're loading one thing to load another thing to drive fifty feet and load another thing. I think it has something to do with like soil compaction and stuff. Who knew there'd be so much science involved? The hot air balloon. Maybe we could pay for a trip in a hot air balloon. Ooh. I don't I don't know how I feel about a hot air balloon though. Are you scared of heights? A little bit. So many new things I've learned about you. I really gotta start listening to when you speak. It'd, it'd be nice. All right, you done eating lunch? Let's go. Yep, look, I'm, I'm ready. Whoa, whoa, how are you going that fast? Uh, I found a button. Makes it go faster. What button? I want that button. I'll show you later. We're almost done, though. It's been a long day. Oh, wait. It probably helps if I hit cruise. It does. Keep going. I think my butt was falling asleep in that John Deere, so I'm glad you switched with me. Hey, it, it, whatever helps you out, man. I kind of broke my inflatable butt pillow. Well, you know you're not supposed to break that, right? I tried not to, but, you know, stuff happens. Man, I hope, I hope we have enough, because we're going to need to uh, fix this. John Deere, before we uh, go and harvest our potatoes. Did you break it? No, it's just, it, it's getting really close to needing a uh, service. I think I'm close to needing a service. Oh, we can't, we can't afford that service. Oh. Yeah, we definitely need to get a service. This thing is starting to shake a little bit, running a little rough. Well, at least it's not slip sliding all over the place anymore. This is true.
got one little row of shame to get, and then we're we're done. I'm glad. See, I I planned this perfectly. You're the one that ended up with the row of shame. Well, I don't feel good about that, but let's be honest. I'm uh, I'm used to the shame. Holy cow! We. Oh wow. So much canola. Yeah, we're gonna have to get a tally on how much we got at the end here. There you go. I need a nap. Is that everything? That's everything. All right. I'll go fill up the semi and and I guess I'll run it over there to the barn. I'll meet or you over the there. The silo. Yeah, that one. There we go. Everything unloading at once. Oh, good old double dump. Hey, canola bath. Isn't that basically a money bath? Yes. Aww. comes there it stops 268,000 liters all right don't count your money yet though don't go crazy no I won't I won't but I mean we do have some silage to sell so I might be able to sell some of that we do I don't well, know sounds like you're gonna be busy yeah you gotta go do your thing so I have to uh, see a man about returning some Perard equipment <laughs> Fair enough. All right, well, I, I, I guess I'll see you tomorrow. All right, good job today. High five. That was awkward. That was, that was really awkward. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to go this way. All right, it's been a long day. We got a lot of harvesting done. 268,000 liters of canola. It's a lot of back and forth, up and down. 4B did a good job. I did an okay job. I hope you liked this video. If you did, hit that like, hit that subscribe. Feel free to leave comments down below. But until next time, thank you for watching.